Hey guys, it's Prince here and today I'm gonna show you how to use FRIP on the device running 7.0 Nougat and I have this Galaxy J7 Prime and in this phone I'm gonna show you how to use FRIP so I already installed it from Play Store you can see here but I have to activate it let's see those steps again how to run FRIP in your phone without routing it this phone is not routed and it's running 7.0 as you can see here anyway let's turn on the laptop and just quickly activate prep so I can show you how to use it I'm gonna turn on my laptop I'm gonna search FRAP and open the first website if you want in detail you can check my other videos I'm just quickly activating it so I can show you how to use FRAP FRAP setup tool for windows and from here I can click on this download and it will download for me this 693 KB file open folder and extract okay the file from my laptop is ready but I have to do something on my phone before I activate it so let's go back to phone here okay if you open FRAP you can see here it says we have to do two steps so first I'm gonna go in settings and from accessibility setting you can see here FRAP FRAP accessibility service you can turn it on from here just allow and now you can see it's turned on so let's go back into about device about phone and if you go on software info you can see here the build number just click seven times and the developer mode is on and if you go back you can see a new option here this one the developer options so if you open it just a little bit down you can see here this USB debugging just turn it on click OK and that's it now we have to activate it from laptop so I'm gonna connect the USB cable and you can see here saying not running so after I complete the steps from laptop it will run perfectly you have to allow it keep your eye on phone and wait while the laptop or your desktop computer install the drivers for your phone after connecting the phone to your computer you will see this option in your phone just click on this icon allow always from this computer and press ok and then allow and my phone is connected perfectly so let's move to laptop and you have to open the last file named as win underscore alt and you don't have to press anything and it says server started initialization finished so let's go back to phone here and at this stage you can remove the cable you don't need it anymore so let's go into FRAP and now it says FRAP service running so if you want to see other videos I have videos about Sony phone uh, Samsung Galaxy C9 and I think another phone so this phone is new and I showed you in NuGet 7.0 how to install and activate FRAP so let's see how this thing works let me adjust my camera here okay after the FRAP service is running you can turn it on and off from this button you will see 
it says service not running and when you click on start again it says service running and you can see this icon here so I'm gonna show you how to use this application so let's say I'm gonna record something from here and put it on repeat so I'm gonna click on tab to show console and I'm gonna record a pattern and Frappe will repeat for me without touching it so let's record it let's say I press on record button and now it's recording star hash zero star hash so let's check a uh, touch I will make a detailed video about this service menu soon I'm just gonna show you how this thing works finger repeat or frep so now I'm gonna turn off my screen and you can see it says recording finished so I'm gonna repeat it to you can type multiple numbers but I'm only gonna repeat for one time so I'm gonna name it service menu and click save so when you go into the phone application you can see here if you click it it will ask to record uh, but when I go to phone I already recorded uh, a pattern from here uh, it shows me that I can play a pattern here so I'm just gonna click on play and it will automatically press star has zero star hash and touch all the screen I'm gonna show you okay I'm not touching anything and I'm just gonna press on play the pattern uh, for repeat one times and that's it you can see it's touching automatically and it will it will go in touch and it will do exactly what I did before see guys I'm not touching anything it's doing itself that's how this application works and it says finished service menu so let's try another thing and try to record another thing so let me see I'm gonna record from here now it's recording so I'll swipe up go in settings about phone and status now I will click back 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 and here now I'm gonna press the power button and it will save the recording you see it's saying now recording finished it's 14.5 seconds so I'm gonna repeat it to 10 times and label as check and save and now I started recording from the main screen so now it's showing me to repeat the pattern 10 times so I'm gonna click on play and it will go in settings and do exactly what I did before click on status go back go back more back and now repeat it again it will do exactly 10 times and if you see in the screen on the bottom side it will tell you that the pattern is finished and the recording is playing to next number you see it said something like 3 of 10 and if you want to stop the pattern or repeating process you just have to press the power button and it will tell you that the operation is aborted so let's try repeating this again it's touching automatically and exactly doing what I did before or what I recorded in the repeat pattern so if you want to stop it just press the power button and when you turn on the screen it says aborted interrupted something like that so it stopped working okay let's try another thing before I stop this video mm, let's see let's go into calculator and you can see the button is gone so I have to again press the show console now I'm gonna record something and it will do exactly what I will record so let's record let's click on record and now it's recording so I'm gonna press 2 plus 2 is equal to 4 and now clear now turn it off and it will save the recording so I'm gonna record it label as 2 plus 2 
and repeat it 10 times so I'm gonna play it from here you can see it's doing it automatically clear so I showed you how to use FRAP and how to abort the process of repeating by pressing the power button and FRAP can hold up to three patterns so I'm gonna go in FRAP and you can see here it says manage traces and I have three patterns recorded already and if I want to record a new one you can see here it says maximum three so if you want, if you want to record a new pattern you have to delete like I'm gonna delete all these three delete checked and I'm gonna click on delete now they are gone so I'm gonna show you that I can record a new one again so that's how you can use FRAP you can use it in many applications as different processes like few times I use this application to send a text message again and again automatically and if this video reached 200 likes I'm gonna show you the same process on Galaxy Dot Edge it will be a different phone and we will try recording it with the pencil or S Pen so stay tuned for more if you like this video please give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe have a nice day and peace out